Hi, and this is Anthony Taggart from the swingengineer.com. In this video, I'll be discussing how the knees operate during the swing, and in particular, the downswing. Now, as far as joints go, our knees are very simple. They permit the leg to bend and straighten, and do so in one plane of motion. So compared to, say, the shoulder joints, there isn't much to think about with the knees. That being said, they are responsible for a few different motions. For example, by simultaneously bending one leg and straightening the other, you can rotate your pelvis. Without this knee motion, you would struggle to pivot the body. During a typical backswing, the left knee bends and the right knee straightens to help rotate the pelvis clockwise. So what happens during the downswing, where we're rotating the pelvis the other way, anti-clockwise? Surely it's just the same but opposite. From the top of the backswing, the right knee bends and the left knee straightens. Not necessarily. If you want to rotate the hips quickly and create a forceful pivoting motion during the downswing, you may want to perform the sit down. The sit down is a position during the downswing where both knees are equally bent, but more so than they were at address. To demonstrate the sit down, Let's take a look at the current world number one golfer on the LPGA Tour, Jin Young Ko. This is Jin Young at a dress with an iron. Here you can see both her knees are slightly bent. At the top of the backswing, her right knee has maintained the same flex it had at a dress, but the left knee has increased its bend. At the start of the downswing, the left knee begins to straighten but the right knee quickly increases its bend. At this point, Jin Young is in the sit down position. Now both legs are bent and more so than they were at the dress. Here you'll note Jin Young's knees appear directly above her toes. Now despite the increased leg bend, this isn't a squat. Jin Young hasn't lowered her upper body throughout this motion and has managed to keep her head relatively stable. So next time you're at the range or watching videos of your own swing, make a note of what your knees are doing during the downswing. If you're lacking in power and the arms are outracing the body during the downswing, the sit down is a great fix. It can help you rotate your hips with speed and initiate the downswing with the pivoting body. The sit down is the 68th lesson from my book, 101 Golf Lessons. If you'd like to discover the other 100 lessons, visit theswingengineer.com for more info.